Hello everybody, it's I, the Waluigi Big Mac, and welcome back to Pizza Tower Noise Update. Uh, part, part of, uh, as a part of, the, as a part of my brand new Let's Play Again, uh, sub-series of Let's Plays. Last time, we completed Floor 1, as well as the Oregano, uh, or, I always, for some reason I always pronounce it Oregano, it's Oregano Desert, that's the proper pronunciation of it. Uh, so, the goal of this episode is to try and com complete the, less of the rest of Floor 2. Which is better said than done because because uh, plus those dungeons not part of it. And yes, I'm still annoyed at at how long it took me to complete a second lap of that level. Yeah, I I I am somewhat concerned for this level, but that's but I'm gonna grab the tapping here. Normally I wouldn't, but consider but considering the noise, how uh. More, how much more difficult the noise controls. It might be a better idea if I just, uh, got the topping right there. After all, I'm not going for P rings anyway. But yeah, uh, the John Go. Oh, right. Uh, I can't access that, uh. I cannot access that, uh, thing yet. Anyway, yeah, obviously the noise is ghost form, uh, or ghost transformation is different. I gotta, gotta love this level. I love this level's music. Get back here! You can't escape me! God, I love that Spider-Man clip. So, the noises... So, the noises go forward differently. Normally, when you play Spapino, you're, uh... You all magically do his dash when you're moving. As a noise, you have to press it. You have to press the attack button for it. Also, I like I like how Pepino just kind of shows up. Uh... I like how Pepino just kind of shows up. Uh... Oh, did I just, did I just say a pepper somewhere? Ah, uh, yes, yes, I did. Nice try, uh, Mini Johns. No witnesses. Yeah, I'm, yeah, unfortunately, uh, Arizona, Tombstone, Arizona, or, sorry, that's the name of the song. Uh, uh, grave, uh, graveyard. Uh, it's a very short level. Oh god, it's John Ghost. We gotta get out of here. Well, we, just, we just gotta go this way. Get that secret.
then I, and since I already collected the mushroom, I could just go up there, go up here. Saves a lot of time, especially if we're doing lap two, with the noises uh, kit here. You jungle. Damn you again, Jungo. There we go. God, okay. Okay, this is okay, this is actually really bad, okay. Fun fact, uh, the noise can just outright kill uh, unkillable NPCs, like Pepperman here. Yeah. Up, oh, don't be rigged because because that that cheese slime there didn't die. Yeah, I'm not. I don't remember if I mentioned why I didn't get P rank on Chunk Gutter in the in my Pizza Tower Let's Play, uh, the, the regular one, the one where I just play as uh, Capino for those who are confused. Uh, but it turns out I did not kill the uh, the cheese slime. I'm pretty sure I did explain it, but I'll explain it anyway. But yeah, I did not kill the, the cheese slime in at the beginning of the level. So because I technically left, so because I. Because I left the room to show off the lap two portal to explain what that does. I no longer I am no longer eligible for a uh, P rank for that. Yeah, and that that was always that was always hard to get. That's the noise for some reason. There we go. Yeah, that guy right there always reminds me of Senor Pello. It, like, I don't think it, that's actually, like, his, uh, 
his uh, original pizza, pizza character. Uh, Pizzona, I think is what it's called. Anyway, Mort. Look at look at him. So anyway, yeah, the, Mort is probably the most changed transformation for the noise. Considering you just use him as a as a boomerang. Damn it, Mort. Yeah, there we go. I was able to get it. <laughs> oh man, that's too funny. Hold on. Give me the cheese guide. Thank you. There we go. Sometimes you gotta spin to win. Yeah, it doesn't matter which, which uh, where your where your range is. Yeah, it doesn't matter what your range or like how far away you are. No, uh, more will usually target the closest thing to whatever you're facing. Which allows you to do some really fuck ass shit. And the other funny part about Mort here, yeah, yeah, he can just flat out kill enemies that's like out bounds. Hold on, like uh, case in point, right there. So fucking cool. Come on, noise. There we go. And then. Yeah, so like, yeah, so movement with board is actually really cool considering, considering how they changed, uh, changed how he works for the, for the noise specifically. Yeah, like, and the flying here definitely, uh, yeah. Yeah, so you can also see how, uh, useful the, the, uh, the, uh, the flying is in that room. This room also, you can see how useful Mort is. Unfortunately, you do need more for here because uh, because of the because of the stupid rat. Like that. Then, 
last two portals right here. Yeah, the fact that you can just skip that portion is insane. Thanks to the noises. Uh, movement. Yeah, whole, holy shit. Like, like I, I already mentioned this either earlier in this episode or earlier last episode, but imagine how the speed runs is gonna go with the noise. Like, holy shit. Salud. Easily my favorite level from this world. Fuck you. So here's the thing. See this horse here? Like, oh, oh, I won. Uh, well, that wasn't supposed to happen. Uh, for those of you who played it, probably know what's going to happen. For those of you who don't, oh, you're you're in for three. Alrighty, uh, the weenie, uh, the the weenie dog. Uh, unfortunately, it's mostly unchanged. It works at... Actually, mostly unchanged. It's pretty much unchanged. It works the same way as the way with uh, Pepino. What if you're like you know racing and then you get stuck on the wind here? Like, oh no, I'm getting stuck on the wind here. Uh, yep. Yep. So I lose. Nah, the noise, the noise never loses. What are you crazy? What do you mean the lo the noise loses? That is blasphemous. trick always helps. Get that uh, last part there. Alrighty then. Get on this bad boy.
few horns. the wind is kind of if anything it's more than loose than anything The horse is respawn, that's funny. I don't know, I don't think. Yeah, there we go. That's another S rank on the board. the outlaw outfit, which, as you may guess, is unlocked by beating the vigilante without wasting a single bomb. You know, I could reveal how, what, the easiest, to, easiest way to, to unlock one of these, but I'll wait. Yep, now, now vigilante, now, now, Vigilante actually does not, uh... He does not give you a, a gun, because, well, we have bombs already, so why should he give you a gun? Yeah, it's always good to th 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 throw a bunch of these guys around, because they'll just... Ah, oh, that's bullshit. Oh, oh well, no P-Rank. Yeah, that's all I hope we get it anyway. Oh yeah, it's, it's a good idea to throw a one, a uh, few of these bombs around, mainly because, mainly because they they will hit the uh, the vigilante. Ow. Because stuff like that, he'll just run into the bombs anyway, so you can so you can basically one tap him each time. And your bombs can also destroy the cow, by the way, so keep that in mind.
There we go. Two. Very easy. I'm going to get a poor score on it, but I don't care. Now, we. I just have to pay attention to draw. Never mind. So, regardless of what button you press, the noise is always going to just shoot, uh, shoot Vigilante before he even has a chance. Crap. Yeah, you, sh you should you should see the D rank uh, image because it's cool. It is quite funny. Anyway, let's just uh, change back to our usual outfit. There we go. And then here's floor three. Uh, you know, let's let's look around a bit, big as we can. Uh, let's do cross code first. Also, my favorite enemies are here, the, uh, the pineapples. You think, I'm not even a big pineapple fan. But I just like how they just pump every time you do. Anyway, uh, the noises barrel does work a lot differently as he can climb up walls with it, as seen here. God, flying is such a good addition. Yeah, unfortunately. Actually, what? I was, it's not like I was going to get P rank anyway. Damn. Oh yeah, so last episode I mentioned about noise the noise having different movesets. Uh, I only mentioned the pogo stick, and the other movesets he has, he had one where he had a washing machine where he where he can use it as like a grappling hook. And then and then he can also throw out bombs with his pogo stick one. And then before we got the final version of the noise here. Uh he now uh, the, before we got the the full final official version of Noise, he pretty much played the exact same as Pepino. So so before so before the Noise got finalized, he was he was just gonna have he was just gonna play the same as Pepino with uh, with different. Hold on, actually. There we go. We still got it. Yeah, you're doing the T doing the tornado can actually activate the uh, the piranhas in here. The noise does get affected by that, uh, 
uh, by the by the water here, except for one level, and you'll see you'll see it when and well you'll see it when uh, when we get there. One thing I should also mention about the noises barrel transformation is that it's a lot faster compared to Pepino's. The noise is just a noise is just a gremlin. Anyway, let's activate the uh, pizza time here. Yeah, this and and this is why the this is why the noise is barrel transformation. It's, it's kind of annoying just because you you just speed up so fast. So if you bonk into a wall, then you're just kind of screwed. Especially, especially in uh, this section, in this segment here. Well, luckily, as long as you take your time, you should be fine. Once you get up, once you get out the barrel the first time, thanks game for, for uh, damn it noise. Okay, you can actually you can actually skip the barrel during during lap two. So so it's advisable to skip the barrel, especially as the noise considering like you may move fast, but believe me, it's more it's, it's more hassle than it's worth. Especially right here, because you'll just go a lot faster with that without it. Especially since your grill can go underneath, can actually go underneath that. Yeah, no. So nice. Unfortunate. So, you know, now I'm thinking about it right now, I'll probably, I'll probably edit this in, but there's a... How, uh, however, uh, the noise had a different, uh, A-rank animation before it got changed. And all, and and this was this was before P rings were a thing, but but it, but but the noise would be sipping on a drink with shade, and you'll just say uh, not an S when you get when you get the A rank. Anyway, let's change into the Force Goblin outfit. Now this outfit is unlocked by 
not killing a single uh, uh, forest, forest noise. Or goblin. Uh, it's unlocked by not killing a single goblin noise in this very level here. Want to why? Hold on, let's. Yeah, see? These, these guys wave, wave at you. Yeah, but you can still kill them. And taunting. Oops. Didn't mean to go up here. Oh no! Well, I already have the outfit, so I mean, it's not a big deal. But yeah, you can, you can accidentally kill them by just move, by just moving around. And taunting will still cause them to uh, will still cause them to attack you. Anyway, in Gustavo's section, you still play as the noise. And this is and this is where the noise pressure comes in, because as you may notice there, it does give you speed. It, it does give you. It does actually give you a jump height. So it's definitely useful uh, if you need an extra boost in height. Useful if you need it, if you especially need a boost in height. Yeah, when I, when I first did that secret the first time, I actually had a bit of trouble because I didn't know, like, I didn't know about the, uh, the noise crusher thing until, until I just started kind of messing around, until I looked it up on the wiki. Ima imagine there, imagine there being, like, a, like, let's just say if I was watching this, uh, noise playthrough for... Oh yeah, by the way, uh, because you don't collect the pieces, you just destroy the, ha the home. Uh, in this level. Imagine, imagine there being a, uh, a incentive for, like, uh, all the games done quick, where you, where you have to go through this level and not kill the, and not kill the gnome noises. Or the, uh, or the goblin noises. Anyway, that's, that's, that's another bad, uh, pizza. Yeah. Uh, the goblin noises do also still get, uh, scared when you're running at them at max speed, so... Yeah, honestly, I think you might be- you might have an easier time P-ranking this, uh... You might have an easier time P-ranking this level in, uh, as the noise, compared to Gustavo and Brick. Mainly- mainly because... Mainly because the noise just moves around a lot faster. Remember to grab uh, Jerome here. Or, well, not in this area, but not this, not the next room. Yeah, this room. Because Jerome is very easy to miss in this room. And and if you miss him, you can't get back to get it, to grab him. And let's see. Uh, the berry bricks there uh, are designed so that way you have enough points to be able to make you defeat rank.
Anyway, back to... There, sadly, there's no longer back to that guy. Which is a bit disappointing, because that is... Because that is a... Because that is a funny brain. Oh, wait. It's not, it's not up here that I have to go. It's up here. There we go. the last secret. Which is actually very easy to get. And we, and we do have plenty of time. This is, this is another, uh, spot to try and uh, do the uh, do the uh, do the flying trick. Oh, hey, I forgot about that. If you have a, over a 50 or more combo, uh, the noise just gets a top pad and monocle and starts acting British. Anyway, that's another EDS rank there. Looks like we barely got it, too. Anyways. Uh, let's, let's put this one on, because the next level is... Because the next level we have to do is... Uh, well, it would be uh, Deep Dish 9. However, we are just about out of time. But before, before we do anything, let's just head up here. <laughs> If you guys enjoy the episode, please consider subscribing as I will really appreciate it. Uh, like and comment, you know, help the, help the channel grow and everything. And with that being said, uh, I hope to see you guys in the next episode where we're going to be completing the rest of Floor 3. Move on to Floor 4, maybe complete that. And yeah, it's going to be a lot of fun considering we're the noise and we're, spe we're basically speed running this. Uh, with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, bye-bye.